In this part, we will see how public transactions are working. We start by creating a wallet on your Sphere Verizon account. You'll have to put a name. We recommend you to put a password. Then you can click on continue. Then you will be asked to generate your seed phrase. So click on generate. As soon as you are sure to be alone in front of your computer, click again on it to make the seed phrase appear. That seed phrase, or backup phrase, will be needed to recover your wallet. So don't throw it and don't share it with anyone. So here, you have your backup phrase. We recommend you to store it in a safe place. Here, we will keep it on a block note for the demo. Check the box on the left and click on continue. You will need to confirm your backup phrase by putting the words in the right order. Now your wallet is created. To begin, one address is automatically created. This is a public address. We also call it a transparent address. Here, we are interested to receive some Zen. So, you will have to click on the green button. Your Zen address will appear as a QR code and characters. You will need to copy the characters. You can give the characters to someone if he has to give you some Zen or copy it to another wallet you manage if you want to do a transfer. Here, we will transfer Zen from another Zen wallet. It is important that your application is 100% synchronized if you plan to do a transaction. Please verify on the left every time you want to make a transaction or a chat. You can go back on Sphere by Horizon and wait for the transaction to be confirmed. Then you can click on Refresh Balance or it will refresh alone and your Zen will appear. Now we will make a new transaction from the Sphere Verizon wallet to another address. In Sphere Verizon, to make a transaction, you'll need to click on the red button to create a transaction. Here, for the example, we go to our faucet webpage getzen.cash. Here, we copy the donate address. In the send section, paste the address where you want to send your Zen and put the number of Zen you want to transfer. Then enter your password. Transaction is quick. You can now click on View on the Blockchain button to see the transaction from the Block Explorer. That's here, and of course, we have to wait to see the transaction confirmed. If we go back to the Faucet webpage, we will see that the balance didn't move a lot. That's because the transaction isn't confirmed yet. On Sphere by Horizon, you can have your balance updated by clicking on My Zen or Refresh or by clicking on your wallet. On the wallet, you only find the transaction history. In the red part, that's all your withdrawals. That's what we are interested in to follow a transaction. By clicking on the transaction, you will have all the details. That can take a few minutes to be confirmed. If we go on the Blockchain Explorer, now we can see that the transaction is confirmed. We can see that it took around 3 minutes for the transaction to be confirmed. And if we go back to the faucet webpage and refresh it, we can see that the Zen arrived.